Yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy Honesty and today I am controlling the gun But I will not be giving you guys any commentary outside of this intro and the rest will all be coming from my boy Seek Don't forget to check out his link down in the description below. He's another fantastic S&D youtuber If you guys really enjoy me, you'll love him. He does a lot more videos than I do But he still has some awesome awesome streams. We play together all the time. We play Fortnite. We play search and destroy we play any game that we really can get our hands on so if you guys want to see just more of me and you guys think that the, he has a great an a little analysis of me words are really hard guys remember that you definitely need to remember this video then you guys should subscribe to him as well don't forget to turn on post notifications for both him and me and i will catch y'all later What's up, Honesty Arming? I have, I have recorded this intro like 10 times, so from here on out, I'm just winging it because I'm kind of annoyed because it's, it's been literally 10 intros. So, uh, yeah, how's it going? Uh, I'm not Honesty. My name is Dylan or Seeker or, or Seek, whatever you want to call me. You can also call me that annoying kid that took over Honesty's channel. Understandable. I, un I get it, okay? But how's it going? Today, we're going to be doing do something that is very common, that commonly done on my channel, known as Analyze a Subscriber, a series where I go in and I pick a random person out of my Black Ops 3 group and analyze their gameplay and break it down and give you guys the good, the bad, the ugly, my thoughts on it, everything I think the person did right, wrong, and what I would do differently, right? Well, Honesty hit me up and he was like, hey man, why don't we analyze each other? Thought it'd be fun. So there's a video on my channel of Honesty Analyzing Me. If you guys want to go watch it, link down below. Also, if you guys want to check out my channel and you don't know who I am and you're not subscribed to me, would appreciate it. Subscribe. You know, you should hit that little red button on my channel as well as Honesty's, right? Be sub to both of us. We both upload, search, and destroy. And the more search for content, the merrier, right? Well, all right. So today we're analyzing Honesty. Let's get it. We got a Man of War rocking a boa, quick draw, and stock. We got one, a single flash, we got the rogue specials on, different, don't really see rogue very often, I like rogue though, rogue's a fun one. And then we've got UAV and uh, and counter UAV, but no third streak, uh, I'm guessing that's on accident, uh, I'm assuming that's on accident, so that's that's a rip in the chat. But, moving on, we're on infection, let's see what the play is, okay. Gonna go left side, hopefully, gonna go to B, yes he is, alright, cool, hop on the wall run and harden the people that are gonna rush you, do it. And gets it, picks up a kill, okay, cool. Alright, didn't really see anybody else pushing that, but still hop on island just to check the corner. Okay, comes around, sees one more on the rock, put shots on him, saw somebody immediately to his right. You can see him right there in the corner, right, uh, right there. So he's got two people here. Alright, what's the play? Is he gonna pick up this guy? Okay, no, jumps off his aim, get double team back up. In this situation, what I would do, if you look over here, you will see he's got a teammate. So this teammate right here has eyes on the guy behind the rock, can put shots on him. But also, if this guy wants to push up, this guy right here, he ran back. But if he wants to come back around and push up, the teammate can pick him up. His name is Grandma Assassin. That's funny. The A is an assassin and Grandma. Let's get creative. Okay, moving on. Let's see what he plays. Let's see what the play is. Okay, so we honestly going to go ahead and jump shot this guy. Doesn't see him. Guy going to run back. He's going to shoot him in the back. Okay. Still have one more guy. Sees him on the map. The guy's pushing him. And picks him up. Hit markers. Jump back. He's going to push you. So immediately jump shot. Immediately jump shot. Got it. Okay, cool. Pulls it off. One guy left. Most likely, this guy, teammates are kind of all over middle, so I feel like they would have seen him push by if he went to A. Most likely, this guy's one of the back buildings, and like the back, probably right corner of the spawn, like near near A, probably. A side, but in their spawn. That That's what I'm guessing. Let's see what Honesty's oh. play is. It's just kind of wrap it through the spawn. Yup, guy ends up being in one of the back buildings in the corner down, on, on the right side, on A side. Lit, dude, I called that. Alright, so, moving on, let's go ahead and go into the next round. Let's see what the play is, dude. Alright everybody, let's go ahead, let's see, is he gonna go B again? That's what I would do, okay, go B, in this situation, so lat so the first round, he ran up, took the wall, ran to jump straight in and hard aimed, and he got a kill. This round, if he thinks about it, and he's being smart about it, he'll hit the wall run, and then right about here, he should jump up top, but I don't think he's gonna do it, because he would have already started his jump, I think he's doing the same thing again. Yeah, he's doing the same thing again, okay. I'm okay with running the same route and search over and over again. I, I'm, I'm one to do it. Honestly, this video of him analyzing me, he I, he caught me running the same route like almost every single round. Typically, I do it because I feel I'm, I'm a little I'm stupidly confident. I think I can pull it off. But if there's like four people or whatever, I don't typically do it. In this situation, I think it was a bad call to run the same route simply because he may have picked up one person here, but there was also two more people. There was one over here. Originally, there's three people right here. Wow, okay. Originally, when he first pushed, he killed one guy pushing up. There was one man here, and then there was one guy over here, right? Speaking of that one guy over here, here he is waiting for honesty. So, 
There's different scenarios. If he would have jumped on the island, I feel like... Is he going to die? I thought I saw a robot. Yeah, okay, so he's about to die. Let's let's play this out. Let's see what let's see how he plays this out. Let's see how this goes, and I'll get into this. So he pushes in, get some hit markers, and jump out of there. Let's jump out of there immediately. Yeah, okay, hop out, hop up, and ready for it? Hit him off. Boom. Okay, so he got sniped by the person all the way over here. The guy that he killed last round who he shot in the back. This guy was waiting for him and ready for him. This is why I didn't like him running the exact same route that he did. Because there were so many people that pushed it last time. Now, I would, like I said, I would have originally jumped all the way up top here. Which would have gotten him killed immediately either way. So I would have called that wrong myself. Keep that in mind. I'm calling this wrong. This route, I called it wrong myself. Honesty called it wrong as well. What he should have done in the end here. This is how it, how it should have happened. All right, I was wrong in this scenario. Honesty was wrong in this scenario. This is how it should have happened after seeing the way this played out. Honestly, should have come through here, seen these two guys, get throw some warning shots, then jumped through here. And they came around the middle and just kind of kind of just sat over here and just kind of kept going back and forth and playing it slow, waiting for them to push up. Because there's a lot of people over here, particularly a sniper that murdered him, that you do not want to get in a gunfight with and did not work out well for him. So, that that is my outlook on that. Now, it's really hard to call that. This is one of those scenarios where it's a route that's really hard to call. Like I said, I would have switched up originally and hopped up here, and I, he still would have gotten sniped. If Honesty jumped up here immediately, still would have gotten sniped, because he later later pushed up here and got sniped. I just wouldn't have personally jumped down the exact same way immediately. But uh, he should have, in the end, just gone this way. As soon as he saw those people, he should have just jumped over through here to safe haven and possibly think about getting a flank on him or just waiting for them to come and push him. That's just that, that, that's what that's in reality what he should have done in that scenario. All right, guys, we are back. We switched up to the M8A7. We got long barrel, elo, and stock on it. And then, by the sounds of no blast reser, I'm guessing afterburner, hardwired, dead silence, awareness. The nerdy, sweaty setup. All right, I see how it is. Gonna push B again, going the same route he did the first round yet again, except he didn't run into anybody running this the first round, so it's totally okay for him to do this again. Let's see if that sniper is around. Yes, the sniper is. And he picked him up. Wow, murders the sniper. Okay, slide over here, hard aim it, because last time there was people here. He does. No one pushes up. He sees people jumping around and, and shots fired in middle. Hard name A, then peek out, trying to pick some of these guys off. One pushes. Ooh, gets him the lucky. Okay. Comes back around. Oh, this just in. He doesn't have. No, he does have rogue. Sorry. He's got rogue. He's got gravity spikes now. Picks up another one up top. Okay. One guy left. Sees him on the minimap in the spawn. Just push him, dude. You got gravity spikes. Gravity spike him for style points. Style points, honesty. Do it. You won't. You won't, honesty. No, you won't. You're going to get shot in the back instead. Oh, turn on him. Oh, rip. Rip. That was just unlucky. He didn't do anything wrong there. He was really ballsy pushing him, but then again, we all would be ballsy pushing the guy on the mini map sitting in a corner. It's just right when Honesty jumped, this kid happened to have an M16 in a brain to jump up behind Honesty and shoot him. You know, you can't you can't prepare for that one, dude. You can't prepare for that one. N nothing wrong in there. He j it happens. That uh, nothing really, not really way for him to fight that there, except for if you would have just panicked and gravity spiked the kid and gotten lucky. Other than that, the dude's on the minimap, sitting in the corner. You just assume he's a bad kid in the corner. You jump shot him to shoot him. Dude jump shots you immediately. It's, you know, you don't always expect that. It is what it is. Nothing much you could do there. All right, guys, this looks to be the final round for the dub. Defend the objective. Let's go. Is he going B again? Let's see. Last time, this went really badly. This, this went very, very, very badly. Let's see if he wants to switch it up and go B this time like originally... Originally, I told him when he ran defense and he died, if you guys remember remember the last time this happened, he ran down here and challenged these guys again, got hit markers, jumped up, and got sniped. And by the looks of things, the sniper's already there. Okay, we'll see how this happens. Let's see if Honesty learns that he should go B this time. Hit the wall run, throw some hit markers down, and cut back into B. Don't jump up top and continue challenging because you will be dead. And I want to point out again, I'm not saying Honesty's a bad player. Like I told you guys, honestly, at least got some hit markers on, guys. I would have hit the wall run and jumped immediately up top here and gotten sniped. So either way, I'm calling this wrong myself. You just got to learn from mistakes. Let's see if he learned, all right? I would have had to learn in this situation. I believe that I personally would be going B this round. But honestly, he did switch weapons. So he, does, he does have that M8 on, so we'll see what, what his play is. All right, he's doing the same thing. Uh, let's see how this goes. I kind of, I, I strongly disagree with it. Let's see, what, let's see how this goes. Okay, maybe he'll get hit markers to pop into B. Maybe he'll get hit markers. Okay, he's gonna pick up one sniper to jump out of there. Jump out of there, jump out of there. Oh, he's going up top. We saw the sniper. Uh, 
Okay, he's going for bow and arrow. Yeah, okay. Honesty, please see the sniper. Please see the... Oh, God, you're dead. You're dead. Honesty, he shot you. Jump out. He jumped up. Okay. He still gets sniped. Rip. All right. Not, not exactly the best play, Honesty. Um, I gotta say, dude, you shouldn't have done that. In this situation, I would have for sure jumped over here as soon as I got in the gunfight with the sniper. I would have ducked in here immediately. Immediately we're ducking here. The same amount of people. This is literally the exact same thing just happened. The exact same thing just happened. He ran down here, got shots on, jumped up here, ignored the sniper on the island, shot at the people over here again, and got sniped. Exact same thing happened. Should have learned from that. Hopefully watching this back, honesty, you'll be biting yourself in the butt and you'll learn from this. Not bad though. He ends up going 7-3. and three. I'm assuming this is the end of the game. Yes, it is. All right. Not a bad game at all. Biggest thing though, honesty... Look at your mistakes. Everybody can do this. Like, I want to specify this. Everybody has this issue. When the first attempt on defense, and I said that he should hit the wall run and then jump over here, he would have still died if he did that. I would have had to learn from the situation and learn to go B. He should have gone B. That's what I would have done in this, this scenario. I would have still died the first time he played defense. But the second time, this route, I, I don't. I, you shouldn't have done that. You shouldn't have done that. It's a good try, though. Not a bad game at all. Teammates still got the win. My man, Grandma, Assassin, coming in 10 and 1, backpacking the team. But either way, not a bad game. Honesty is extremely solid player. Just wasn't able to grasp that route uh, with that many people. Just didn't think the sniper was going to do it again, but he did. Either way, not a bad game at all. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Be sure to leave a like. If you did, I want to specify first and foremost because I've had this. This is not the first time I've done an analyze video on someone else's channel. If you have an issue of me saying, if you think I said that honesty is bad in any way, shape, or form, blah, 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 I literally, no, I, I'm not saying he's bad. Honesty is just as good as I am. I'm just giving my look on what I would have done in the situation. And I believe I would have. I would have thought it through to go B, whereas Honesty didn't think it through to go B. And like I said, the first time he died against the same scenario, I would have just jumped up top and gotten sniped immediately, whereas Honesty would still jump down here and got some hit markers on a guy first. At least he was able to damage somebody. I think I would have died immediately. That's, just, that's what I think would happen. I'm not bashing on Honesty in any way, shape, or form. I am here to simply give you guys my input on what I think he should have done in these scenarios and how I think it could have played out a lot better better anyways i hope you guys enjoyed the video be sure to leave a like if you did if you guys like this type of video and and or other live streaming and and search and destroy related stuff i do upload every single day over on my channel and i typically do an analyze video like this about once every week or two on my channel as well it's a pretty consistent series so if you guys want to come over shoot me a sub i really appreciate that it would mean a lot as well as a subscribe to honesty because the dude is on that road to 3k let's get him there thank you guys so much for watching Hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you all eventually. I don't know, gonna see you when I play with Honesty on stream, because I'm probably not going to upload on this channel for a while. Have a great day, guys. I will see you guys later. Seek and destroy. It's been Seeker.